TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on Friday, the 5th of November. A lot to do, so let's run through. The Dow futures up 141 at an all-time high. We're looking to see whether or not there's some kind of pull. The jobs report obviously has been uh, uh, approved by the market. So we're looking at higher highs, all-time highs in the Dow. The uh, All I can say is that if after 1.32 o'clock this afternoon, the Dow is 90 points or more, the cash Dow itself is 90 or more points higher, then there's probably going to be a, a bit of a squeeze into the close. But if there's a pullback, gradual pullback over the day, we'll see because the Dow's only up 30 points. It says, uh-oh, could see some weakness into Monday. Uh, we're looking at the S&P right now, the S&P futures. I'm going to go to the continuous contract. Uh, very sharply up, up 20 at 46.93, all-time high. The actual cash has gotten that leg D that we were talking about probably uh, going to extend today. And we'll see, because if the futures are up um, less than eight points after two o'clock, it says, oops, some kind of a digestive phase could be unfolding over the next couple of days into Monday, Monday, Tuesday. But if it's holding 12 or 15 points higher, that's going to be really good for the close. QQQ, QQQ is the NDX 100, very strong, 399.49, up $1.27. It looks like it's going to try to challenge the 400, 403 area. This is very good action, and it should hold strong, Qs should hold strong into next week. The IWM, the Russell 2000, trading right now up to 19 at 240.74, all-time high. This has been uh, actually turned into a leader, and that's going to be very important. Now, let's go through this very quickly. Gold gold is uh, unchanged right now. It's had a good move up. But look at the dollar. The dollar is close to its most recent high. In fact, it's pennies away from that high. If it actually breaks into the 94.70 area or higher, uh, and in fact, it's now at 94.60, this is going to be very strong, good action. Crude oil, I think, is pulling back. It's, making it, it's made it top. Uh, for subscribers to opening call, we had already got this as a, as a turnaround the other day at 85.41. It's now trading at 79.66. Looks to me like crude oil is going to be settling down for a little while. Just wanted to go through these quickly. Look at wheat. Uh, wheat has made a peak E. Corn has made a peak D. So even the grains are pulling back here. This is a very, a very uh, diverse market with some things pulling back and others going to all-time highs. So have a wonderful day. Watch the VIX index. If the VIX index trades at 15 or lower, that's very positive for the market. And watch it if it goes to 15.60 or higher. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned for Tommy.